My first relationship with the reservoir was a no trespassing sign. There's something wrong with the no trespassing sign when there's a place for kids to go to. And we kind of like came up with an idea to start doing signs here. Project Reservoir, initially when we started it, the, the goal was always to make this Jersey City's own environmental learning center. A lot of Project Reservoir is majority of the times in the classroom and when there the kids develop their technologies, um, they find solutions to problems that they basically identify here and in our local urban community. Compost itself can still reach the top. Early exposure to science, lab work, I think really gives these kids an idea and a direction of something that they can do. They both encourage us to learn more and to be someone special in life. Low when it comes in like that. They are amazing. They are amazing and everything they do as, as teachers, as mentors, their love and dedication, not only for science, for Project Reservoir, and most of all for their students, it's definitely something to be admired. And when I hear stories of these students saying, I'm going to be an engineer, or a parent asking, can my son be an engineer? Those are like things that I know, I, oh, there I go, I can't quit. I'm always a proponent and uh, try to foster the development of, of STEM-based activities and, and hands-on activities. And then from there, they develop that spark. And then once that spark is ignited, you know, they could take that and, and use that to ignite the, the rest of their future. Watch American Graduate Day on NJTV on September 27th at 11 a.m.